<laughs> Hello, my name is Grand Ochita, and today we will be reviewing not only cosplay, but fans as well. And not, I'm, I'm not talking about ceiling fans. Some of the comments in my My Hero Academia videos state that the fandom is toxic. And I was just kind of curious as to see if that was true or not. So what I did was I tried to find proof of this. And what I have here is a video that is supposed to be them being extremely weird and annoying and cringy at cons. I don't know if this is going to be considered toxic, but this is the closest thing I could find to people who state that they are being toxic. So let's dive right into it and see if My Hero Academia fans are actually toxic or if they're just misunderstood. So I'm at the Louisville Supercon, GalaxyCon with uh, my boyfriend. And I saw some, I, they couldn't have been older than 15. It was, a, it was a cosplayer dressed as Toga dragging around a Bakugo on a chain, which chase your bliss, whatever. But they walked by me and the toga said, Oh look, that toga has an unchained dog. Silly toga. Like, what the f***? You're four- You gotta be like 14. What the- What the f***? I- I know. I- I'm actually on her side with this. I've noticed that as the generations of cosplayers get younger, they're a little more detached from reality. This is the best way that I can put it. I know about, like, the toxic BNHA kids, but, like... See? See? Okay, so that's what... That's, that must be the thing that people were talking about in the comments. Toxic My Hero Academia kids. So, I guess that we're on to something, aren't we? I haven't witnessed it till now. Mmm, the plot thickens. See, I thought that it was just people trolling on my comment section. I didn't realize that this was actually a thing. No! Somebody wants I have video footage of other people doing this for another anime. Can somebody in the comments below tell me if this is like a cult thing? I, I, I've seen people T-posing in a circle doing weird stuff like this before. And I don't understand it. I'm more concerned about the people who actually make those songs than the ones who just lip sync to them. I don't know, man. Music is weird nowadays. You make me a maniac, but you don't know. Oh. When was Deku ever a vampire? Oh, we're back here again. For another sacrifice, great. going on I don't like that never happens at the cons that I go to like what convention is that what? that's weird I hope that these kids know what they're doing like I don't want to end up seeing like some some little baby being sacrificed for the Boku no Hero crowd Oh my god, dude. A group of My Hero fans saw me buy a Todoroki shirt at Hot Topic and followed me into the bathroom and are standing in front of my stall chanting one of us. I can't help, I can't leave, they are T-posing and one of them took a big f- <laughs> I just noticed that she's covering her nose, or his nose, her nose, I can't tell who it is. 
That's funny. Somebody wants to me it's your power! Dude, this is like the Uganda Knuckles meme. Do you guys remember that? Like in VR chat when people will just like, um, uh, turn into the little Uganda Knuckles and start like running around in VR and like asking people if they know where if they know the way like that's what this looks like to me this is straight up VR chat in real life your Todoroki your mother burned your face and she left and now you're gay somebody once told me it's your power Todoroki I can't tell if these are the same kids like I can't tell if they just go to random Todoroki's and think that they're being creative by like constantly singing this song and annoying the crap out of them it does not make sense and it's got it's always Todoroki too that I've noticed that like for some reason people have this weird gravitational pull towards this character I'm just trying to eat my cup of noodles we're getting closer oh my god so this looks like this is, I almost want to say that this is all at just like one convention. Fun, fun, fun. Abe, are you enjoying your first time? <laughs> oh, it's their first time at a convention and they see a bunch of cult leaders running around T-posing, yelling sacrifice in one of us. Amazing. I just got home from my first convention as a cosplayer and I already have a story to tell. Call it... The cult of the 12 year olds. So I went as Gender Mint Toga, my brother went as Shigaraki. And so this little girl, hair remember- You can tell that this person just came back because his hair is in like wig formation under the cat, under the skin cap. Remember if she was Uraraka or Toga. <laughs> and, but she and a couple of her friends, they ran up to us and they were just like, Do you want to join our cult? So me and my brother, we both laughed. We were just like, sure, why not? And so after a while, they amassed about 13 or 14 people, all of them around the ages of 12 to 14. And I think we were probably the oldest. And then after a while, they started doing the normal things of um, screaming at the top of their lungs. Every, every, just about every 15 minutes, they, they yelled at the top of their lungs, plus ultra. At that point, me and my brother just ran away because we didn't want to deal with that. But I heard them doing the It's Your Power Todoroki thing. And there was about 25 of them at that point. <laughs> I like how he started off with an almost full ice cream cookie. And then it slowly went down as the story progressed up until the point when there was no more cookie in his hand. Oh, that's it. Alright, well I guess that that is the video. Um, is the My Hero Academia fandom toxic? I'll let you decide. Personally, I have not seen that many crazy, um, incidences at a convention with them. Uh, there's, I think that certain kids at conventions are just weird in general. That's probably because the parents let them watch way too much anime that's not meant for kids of that age group. I'm not gonna judge, I mean, it's just, it is what it is, I guess. My cult, academia, whatever you wanna call it. Supposedly, it's real, because it's not like, it's, it's not, it might not be that bad in Hawaii, but clearly, in other places, it can be pretty, uh, intense. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, let me know what you want me to watch next, and maybe, um, I don't know, I'll, I'll figure, I'll, I'll do like a shout out or something. I'm gonna take a nap now. Bye-bye. <laughs>